Hey everyone, it's Wolf Bro back with another mind YouTube tutorial. Today I'm going to show you how to make a thumbnail using Paint.net. First thing you need to do is go image resize and resize it 1280 by 720. I would just zoom out here. Now the first thing you need to do is just find a cool background for it. So I'm going to make this video's thumbnail actually. So first I'm going to go to Google Images. This is very similar to my channel art one except for this. You know, you er, you don't need it to be under 4 megabytes. For this one, it can be any size. Oh my gosh, why did I take cool back? Whatever. Um, oh my god. Why do I keep doing this? Okay, and then I go search tools, size, exactly 1280 by 720. <clears throat> um, what's a nice one for this? Um, oh, um, it's always a tough choice to decide, always tough, uh, oh, it's some pretty bad quality, so I'm not doing that one, this one looks sort of nice, and yeah, it's still not very good quality, I gotta find that one that's good quality. Both of these are horrible quality. <clears throat> okay, this one's good. So, I'm going to go to Paint Out and I just paste it. Now I'm gonna make a new layer for my text. Again, going to Cool Text. I'm gonna take care of this business. Okay. Um, then I'm gonna just select a nice font I like. If there isn't really one, I can always go to the top and select a certain type of font that I'd like it to be. So if I go here, and I click Comic, and... Uh, you supply fairy cakes. Okay, now I go to skate, and I just type in what it's going to be. Okay, here, how to create a YouTube thumbnail. And then you can use the gradient or just select certain colors. So here I'm going to make it a greenish one. Sort of like that. Yep. And then I'll go just create logo because it looks nice. So now here I'm going to copy this image. And paste it on the new layer. Just like this in a spot where everyone can see it. Then I'm going to make another one. This time it's going to be. Come on. Huh. Why wasn't it responding? I'm going to write tutorial. This time the logo. It's just going to have. Uh, just three white bars, just like this tutorial. That actually looks pretty nice like that. Then here I copy it. And I go to paint.net and I paste it. Now here what I'm going to do is, okay, 
eventually you'll find this arrow. Basically, just have to like rotate that to rotate it something. And I can't see the tutorial the most clearly, but the white gives it away, so <clears throat> you can see it. And that's really all there is to it. I just save as. I just go to downloads or whatever. But first, before you can do that, you need to click merge layer down, so that way it's all one layer. Otherwise, you can't save it to .png. And just go to your desktop or whatever and save it as tutorial thumbnail. <clears throat> I'm gonna save that. Um. <clears throat> yep. <clears throat> well, my throat's clogged up today. I'll go to YouTube now. If I would like to upload it, what I could do is, for example, if I want to put it on this one, which I'm actually going to do later, I would go to Video Manager, and it takes me here. I'm going to hit Edit on the one I want to, and I'll just hit Custom Thumbnail here. If you don't have this button, it is because you need to confirm your account for this to work. Then just wait for a little bit and it'll upload. I'm not actually going to have that upload. Just so cancel. But eventually it will upload. So here I'm going to just put this in 60 jumps. And save changes. Um, But yeah, that's all you need to know. And I hope you enjoyed this video. If you find it helpful, be sure to leave a like, comment your thoughts, and subscribe. Until then, this has been How to Make a YouTube Thumbnail.